Hey guys, I'm back from our cruise. I just want to let you guys know within the next two weeks, I'm going to try and post some stuff from our cruise and things I saw. So just be on the lookout for that. But I'm back here with some new movie reviews. Hey guys, thank you for joining the quest again today. I am your host Marquise Underway and today I'll be reviewing Mission Impossible Rogue Nation, which is directed by Christopher McQuarrie and it stars Tom Cruise, Jeremy Redner, Ving Rhames, and Simon Pegg. Now this movie is what I want in a spy movie. For me, the whole Mission Impossible series has kind of been like the American James Bond to me. So, you know, everybody here knows I love James Bond, so I definitely love this one. And it's really different from James Bond, but it's similar at the same time. I would say it's less serious than James Bond. The comedic elements kind of help for that to happen, but I still enjoy it a whole lot. The acting in this movie is great. Tom Cruise does his thing. Simon Pegg shows off some dramatic chops, which I didn't really know he had. Um, the female lead, I forgot her name, but she's really good too. I enjoy that Ving Grimes had some more screen time because in Mission Impossible 4, he was there for maybe like a scene or two, but in this one, he's still like behind the scenes, but he's more in tune with the story, which I really enjoyed. And Jeremy Rettner, you know, he just does his thing. Now what this movie is really about, it's about the IMF. They're just trying to stop the syndicate, which is believed by Alec Baldwin. to not exist anymore. They're just trying to stop them because they're trying to frame the IMF and just take over as usual. Um, the villain to me, he was kind of okay. He wasn't great and he wasn't bad. His voice kind of reminded me of Eddie Redmayne's voice in Jupiter Ascending, so it kind of got old. And um, I really didn't feel his motivation, so I really thought his role kind of took down the movie. But the action scenes in this movie was really, really good. They're probably on par with Furious 7 and Mad Max Fury Road, in my opinion. Um, the car chase scene with the motorcycle, that's one of the best car chase scenes I've ever seen in my life. There's a scene with Tom Cruise and he's underwater. And if you know anything about Tom Cruise, he does his own stunts. So he's really underwater for three minutes. And it's really just believable. Just You just see him do his thing. And it's just really amazing to know that he's really doing that. And he's putting that much dedication to his role. And same thing with the plane scene, which is in the trailer. It's really in the beginning of the movie. But it's just still amazing. The guy's really on the plane holding on to it for dear life. And... That really takes courage, so I have to respect him for that. This is one little moment where the car flips during the car chase scene. I could tell it was CGI. It kind of took me out the movie a little bit, but it didn't really hurt it in my opinion. Overall, I really enjoyed this movie. I'm giving this movie an A+, a 4.7 out of 5. I really hope Spectre can compete with this since it's a spy film, but I really thought the action scenes in this film were amazing. The acting was great, and the story was good. The only downfall to me was just a little CGI scene in the villain. I thought the villain could have been a little bit better. But this is still a good time. If you're a fan of Mission Impossible or spy films for that mention, please go see this movie. So, have you seen Mission Impossible Rogue Nation? If you have, comment below. Let me know your thoughts on the movie. What's your favorite Mission Impossible movie? I want to know. Comment below with that too. If you're new to my channel, subscribe. If I hit 50 subscribers, I'll start a new series on here called My Favorite Movies. I'll go through the top 10 movies that I already have online. And then I'm just going to do the rest just off the top of my head. So... Thank you for joining the quest again today. I'm your host, Marquis Thunderwood, and join the quest.